What is going on everyone and welcome back to the channel today I've got another Fallout 76 Atomic Shop video to be going over with you guys in today's video We actually have a, a new addition to the Atomic Shop called Responders We do have the Responders bundle on here which is limited 19 days Answer the call and save the wasteland with this improved Responders rescue bundle Includes Order of the Crossed Axis Decoration, Responders Red Player Icon, Responders Paint, uh, Responder Power Armor, the Responders Rescue Backpack, Responders Plywood Signs, Claxton Wall, uh, Wall Light, uh, the Blue Responders Flag, Responders Fire Braves Flag, a Braves Flag ra rather, the White Responders Flag, the Responders Armor Workbench, Responders Power Armor Station, and Responders Weapons Workbench. So. Yeah, quite a tongue twister. There is a lot of stuff in here, and oh my god, does that power armor have headphones, or am I tripping balls right now? What the actual, what? It has headphones, yeah? I'm not the only one that's fully tripping on that, and this man's winking at me. I don't like that. I don't like that at all. We got the, uh, the, the tent, or whatever it's called, that Fallout first pay-to-win crap. Uh, again, that's there. We got the Responders Power Armor Paint. Get out there and help those with the, the responders power armor paint includes a unique paint for all power armor That is headphones, right? What the hell? He's got the mic. He has the mic like me. My man stole my headphones and then Put it on a power armor. That is incredible. That takes dedication That is almost as elite as Ben Shapiro, but obviously not as elite as Ben Shapiro Again, this isn't a bad paint, but the price for 1500 is ridiculous. I hate how they're so expensive is he holding up a badge? Can you take a badge off? That would be cool. That'd be a nice animation, I guess. Vault Tech Fountain, the official Vault Tech Thirst Quencher. The Vault Tech Fountain will dispense water. This item cannot be built inside of a shelter, which is a little bit disappointing. Uh, this is for 500. We also got the rescue, or the responders rescue backpack. The perfect backpack for all your medical supplies. Uh, when heading the wounds of your fellow Appalachians, this skin can be applied to both the small and standard backpacks as a mod. We also got the responders plywood sign. Uh, let those in need or let those in need know that you can provide the aid and support of the responders with the responders plywood sign. That is pretty cool, I guess. Um, we also got the clacks and wall lights. So that's just like a, a wee woo wee woo ambulance police siren. For 250, let your visitors know if someone, uh, if something wrong with the Claxton wall light. We also got the Order of the Crossed Axe decoration, which is pretty cool for 250. It's got a firefighter's helmet with two axes. And then we got the Responders paint for 400, which is, oh my god, 400. Let's put this into perspective here. On Fallout 4, you can get this for free. Yes, you can get free Pit Boy paint jobs on the Creation Club weekly. Why is this 400 atomic points, Bethesda? I don't get it. 400? Responders red player icon for 150. Not really much into that one. We've got the Hellfire regular prototype uh, paint set, which is also straight out of Fall Fallout 4. And yeah, this is a lot cheaper in Fallout 4 as well. Uh, this 1,200. Mr. Fuzzy power armor helmet, which is sick, I will admit, for 500. And we also got cash registers for 500, which is also really cool because it's like a player vendor. So that is really nice. We also got the Liberty Prime Power Armor Skin Set for 1,440. The Stars Bundle for 1,500. The Down the Home Dweller Bundle for 1,000. Uh, the Down Home Comfort Bundle for 1,500, which is pretty cool. Some stuff in here. Uh, we got the camp scrap, or the scrap kit rather, times 40, which we won't cover too much. Pay to win stuff. Stay away from me. Uh, give you the, give you the don't argue right there, mate. Uh, we got the responders fire uh, chief a uniform for 630. Uh, the responders sash box for 350. The ambulance gurney bed set for 175. Not sure why anyone would want that. That is a bit odd. For decoration, I guess, but... I don't, know, I don't want to be sleeping on one of those things. We also got the responders photo uh, mode frame for 75. Then we got vaulting. We got the square rug bundle for 500. We got the uh, decorative room divider for 250. The avocado square rug for 200. The beige square rug for 200. 
the charcoal square rug for 200, maroon square rug for 200, and teal square rug for 200. We also got sparklers pose for 350, which is pretty cool. And the West Virginia backpack for 350, which is also pretty cool. Then we got special, we got nice camp, which we already own. We'll get that back on. And a free trail fireworks. We'll grab that. And 400 down to 200, we got the well-traveled paint. Again, 280 rather. This is for free. You can probably get a similar thing for free on the Creation Club Bethesda. You're a cash grab on Fallout 76. I'm not going to lie. But of course, I'd very much like to hear all of your thoughts and opinions on this. Did you guys like this week's update? Did you guys not like it? Of course, I'd very much like to hear all of your thoughts and opinions on this down below. But of course, don't forget to subscribe to my gaming channel and my IRO slash long channels. And don't forget to check out my podcast as well if you haven't already. Links for them will all be on the description down below. But as I'll send out to thank you guys so much for watching this video. Make sure to leave a like, subscribe, and comment. And I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.